Pretty great to see Alex out there really get into that rhythm early and, and was quick to the plate and aggressive. Well, definitely, too. And, and also, he had a little bit of velocity today compared to his first start. So I think he's just getting stronger. Did a great job today, got deep in the game, and really, we're only able to use two bullpen arms today, so that helps a lot. Joey, uh, really, for the last month and a half, has really started to swing off balls, really coming off his bat. Nice oh, he's jumping off his bat, uh, really, the last couple weeks. You know, he's been working really hard with Turner and Donnie, and, and it, it's you're starting to see it. And uh, big, that two-run homer in the first. Get a lead against this team. They did the exact same thing to you last night. It just seems like when you guys, especially the Reds, get those runs early in the game, it's just tough to beat. Well, it's def it definitely helps. I mean, anytime you score early, you know, you're, you're playing catch up, and, and, and they're a dangerous club over there. I mean, they can hit the ball out of the ballpark, and, and uh, no, no lead is safe. So, But it's good to jump out early and, and, and get a couple runs. Yeah, so I had some great defense out there again, and Senzel had two really nice plays. Yeah, he did. And the one against the wall was big, lead off the inning. I, I, made that play against the wall and then the diving play so overall it was a solid game i think overall by you know pitching and defense to have a guy like michael lorenzen that's able to go multiple innings and then go out in the field how, how useful is he on a team he's a tremendous athlete you know um he just he, he he's just a great athlete. He can do a lot of things for us. He pitches. You know, he's one of our better outfielders actually. When when he goes out there, so we're always looking for spots uh, to put him in. How weird does it go for Tim with runs in scoring position to still get the win? <laughs> Say that one again. You go for ten with runs in scoring position. You well, know, I, we got some field. We got we got some timely. You know, we got a couple field of choice. Sack fly there. Um, it was some, some timely hitting and, and and the home run. Like I said early and great jump by Peraza. Score on the on the contact play there. That uh, the ground ball. I think Winker hit on the ground ball. So yeah, I mean it was a good base run. Yeah. Check on Alex. What? It was a quick visit, but. It was quick. I mean, it looked like he was cramping up a little bit, but he said he was fine, that he could finish, and he was doing well. So it was just kind of a quick, because you saw him walking around a little bit, and he was just cramping up. He asked you about Alex in the beginning, given, like, all he's been through with the injuries and everything. To have a performance, like, I know he pitched well in the first game, too, but to have a performance like this, what do you think it does for the confidence team? Well, it's a lot. I mean, he's a proven veteran. I mean, he's played in, he pitched in some big games. Um, so it's, it's great for him, too, especially early on. It's, it's tough when, when pitchers are on the IL early in the year and they're trying to come back and they're trying to prove a lot of things. You know, it's a new team. Uh, but he pitched well the first time out. He, he didn't go as deep as he did today. Today, I thought he was, he looked like Woody. Hmm. What, what do you think? I mean, he doesn't have like overpowering stuff, but what makes him so effective against a lineup like this? Well, he could change speeds. You know, he's got the secondary pitches. He can go in and out, up, down, and his velocity, you know, and especially when it's 92 to 93, a little bit harder, that change up and breaking ball play better. So it's, it's, he's a proven veteran, knows how to pitch, and he's left-handed.